Welcome back, scientists. This is Ms. Jetha from Seattle, Washington, bringing to you Lesson 6 of Natural Selection. Now, if you haven't had a chance to watch Lesson 4 or Lesson 5, make sure you go back and watch those two lessons, which will help everything come together a little bit more. So here we go with Lesson 6 of Natural Selection. Here's what you'll need for this lesson. A pencil or pen, some lined or blank paper, an optional but encouraged, a family member, friend, or a pet you can check in with, and a lesson six packet that was provided to you by your teacher. Let's go ahead and warm up. Pause the video and read Sherman story number three right here on the right hand side. Turn and talk to a friend, a family member, or jot your responses down on a piece of paper about the following questions. What do you think Sherman is right about? And what do you think Sherman is wrong about? Carefully read um, the dialogue between the two characters and see where do they go right and where do they go wrong? Here's what I notice here. In our illustration, we have green dragonflies and brown dragonflies. Now, what we know is that in this environment, many years of lots of rain, cause the environment to become very lush and green. Now, Sherman understands clearly that the brown dragonflies all got eaten because their predator could see them more easily in the green environment. And he understands that green, therefore, is an adaptive trait for the green dragonflies. And that's because being green helps them to camouflage and thus survive and reproduce more. Now what Sherman doesn't have correct here is when he says the very same green dragonflies are still alive today. That's not true. What we see is that these green dragonflies must be as a result of being the offspring of green dragonflies generations ago. We know that those green dragonflies probably have died and thus um, the offspring carries on the trait which was adaptive for being green because it could survive and reproduce more. And thus, in the environment, now we have more green than brown dragonflies.